Hey kids, welcome to Story Hour Online. Looks like it's going to be a hot one today. So what have you been observing when you've been outside, When it's hopefully when it's cooler? I have a monarch that visits me every day. A couple of hum hummingbirds. That's nice. I see lots of bees getting the pollen from the flowers. We kind of need those guys, don't we? So today's book is simply B. It's a peek through picture book. Can you see the B through all the layers of the book? The story was written by Patricia Hagerty. And the illustrations or the pictures are by Britta Tekentrup. Dawn is breaking on a brand new day. And in the meadow, poppy sway. So dawn is early morning and poppies are these red flowers. A bee appears, striped black and gold. A wonder of nature is about to unfold. In the treetops, birds start to sing. The little bee beats her wings as she travels here and there. A gentle humming fills the air. Back and forth, to and fro, bee knows exactly where to go. Visiting flowers of every hue, she has a special job to do. Gathering nectar as she goes, from every foxglove, every rose. Dusty with pollen, the little bee buzzes, buzzes busily. Bee travels on from bloom to bloom, drawn in by their sweet perfume, harvesting flowers one by one. Her compass is the midday sun. A compass is like it it tells you where to go and it leads you. Among the orchids I'm sorry, among the orchards, apple trees, blossoms quiver in the breeze, carrying pollen from place to place, be always leaves a tiny trace. Flowers as far as the eye can see, too many flowers for just one bee. All of a sudden, bee is gone. She has a message to pass on. Back at the hive, bee spreads the news. There's work to be done. No time to lose. Listen further, gentle humming. The word is out. The bees are coming. Buzzing over the dense hedge grows, past the pond where the wild thyme grows. Through the orchard's sweet smelling scent, the bees travel on with calm intent.
as lilies glow orange in the sun. The bees must finish what they've begun. Stopping at every flower they find, leaving the gift of pollen behind. <gasps> oh my. The bees pass over a woodland stream. Droplets sparkle and pebbles gleam. Water trickles, bubbles and weaves. A weeping hot willow trails its leaves. As the bees fly on through buds and burrs, tiny miracle occurs. So many plants and flowers you see were given life by one small bee. The end. So next time you see a bee, guys, think of all the things that it does for us by pollinating our flowers and helping them to continue through the years. So today's craft, there's lots of bee crafts out there. I kind of like this one. It's in the shape of a circle. That's right. And it's got little heart wings. Okay. So print you some big round circles and don't forget the the stinger at the bottom. Okay. I hope you have a good day, guys. Stay cool out there and I'll see you next week. Bye.